Hello to uh, Anna and Emil on Skype. Uh, where in the world have I reached you today? Hello. We are now in Bruksvallarna in Sweden. We have our last training camp now before the season starts. So we have been there for a, for a week. Yeah, for a week. And it's really good condition for training. So. Okay. Yeah, Is it nice. nat- natural snow or it's uh, man-made snow? Uh, it's both. Up on the mountain it's natural. Or how do you say it? Yeah. It's, yeah, natural snow, but... Down here, it's more, yeah. Produce snow. So Produce snow. Yeah. we have done really good <laughs> conditions, actually. So yeah. we have our Swedish uh, first uh, first race uh, first race of the season. It's in one and a half week uh, here in Bruxvalla. So everyone is coming here now. More and more people from the Swedish ski families showing up here and preparing it's, for the for tons season. Of people here. <laughs> <laughs> everyone is here now. Yeah. And uh, and so when will you leave um, Brooksvallena to go to um, Kusumo? We we will leave uh, after the competition here and have a few days at home, and then we fly to Kusumo on Wednesday the twenty seventh, perhaps or something yeah. like that. Yeah, that sounds so about right. We'll have yeah. I think we'll have two days at home. So. Yeah. Before and, uh, we, before and, the season starts. And this is in home is in Ostersund. Yeah. yeah. Okay. This time. Home is yes, yeah, <laughs> yeah. In the in the in the off season, you spend some time still in uh, Davos. Yeah, not yeah. that much this year. Emma spent like two weeks uh, in the summer, and we sp- ah, we spend the whole spring in Davos. But <laughs> you're gonna be more and more to the to the Olympics. Yeah. You're gonna be more and more and have the base in Davos. Yeah. Okay, so to from, get that altitude. From Hammer, yeah. Yeah. Okay. Okay. And um, speaking briefly of the off season, the the training has been going well for you guys. Yeah, it's it's been a really good year of training. I had a big problem with my coughs, but uh, I've been training good. And unfortunately, I have missed a few camps because I have had to follow my own plan. But for me, the, anyway, the training has been really good, and I've been longing for the competition for a while now. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. And also, my, my summer was really great, actually. My best summer ever in training. But uh, now the the last month, one and a half months, have been really bad with with a few weeks of, uh, of sickness. So I'm just now on the... Uh, I will just start training again and coming uh, back to, to good shape. So, Better than the yeah. normal day. <laughs> yeah, so I don't know. So I hope the mix of the good summer and the bad uh, okay. fall is going to be... <laughs> Super. <laughs> yeah, and so you won't delay your World Cup season. You will still begin in Kusumo. Yeah, exactly. I'm going to s- probably skip the Swedish Open in here in Bruksvallarna and just train really hard for a few weeks, uh, get one more week, and then uh, start the season in Kusumo. And uh, with it being a, an Olympic season, um, lots of athletes are uh, going to take a pass on the Tour de Ski this year. Will that be the same for you guys? We think so. Uh, we don't know yet how the season starts, and but um, hopefully we can skip the two to ski and have a really good um, period of, of training during Christmas and New Year. Um, but since the two to ski is so fun to ski, uh, if I need to ski it, I will ski it with happiness. But <laughs> I hope I can have a good period of training. Yeah, and I will see if everyone else skip it. I will do it. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Exactly, yeah. Yeah. So we will see. That's a very good, good plan. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, but we will see. In in the in my plan, plan A, I'm not going to go to two ski, but you never know. If I want to have more competition before the Olympics, if something happens, I would love to go because it's a really fun, fun competition. And um, speaking of the Olympics, uh, I saw recently that um, the ski day for the, the Swedish team in Stockholm drew in uh, 59 journalists. Can you guys feel the energy from uh, the, the spectators, the fans of the sport, that the, the games aren't far away? Yeah, yeah. really. It's, uh, you can really, especially on the, on the um, press conference, it was tons of journalists and all the questions about uh, the Olympics. And here in Sweden, we can also feel that the interest has been high because we have the world champs in Sweden next year. So, yeah, the interest is really good. Yeah, I can see the hat. Yeah, the media, everything has been bigger and bigger every year. Yeah. Um, but now you can really feel that all the questions is about the Olympics. So you can you can start to realize that it's something big coming up this year. So yeah. you won't miss it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. 
Well, I, I will continue that trend and then uh, uh, further with a, an Olympic question. Um, yeah. And I'm going to skip Sochi and I'm going to skip Korea in 2018 and and discuss briefly that Stockholm has applied for 2022 for the Olympics. If I yeah. if I do my math, that would be the fourth Olympics for both of you. Uh, might we see you racing at that time still? You never know. <laughs> uh, you will never say never. But uh, hopefully I... We'll sit in the audience with uh, tons of kids. <laughs> I don't know. And I was key. Okay. Yeah, exactly. No, but uh, you never know. No. Uh, you will see how everything goes and how fun you still think training is because that is the thing to the main real reason. yeah main reason. If, but uh, you never say never. Maybe maybe okay. we'll be there. It's gonna be extremely good for Sweden and extremely fun for Sweden if you get the Olympic. But it's I think it's a tough game there against the Norwegians in Oslo, so applying for the for the same same Olympics. So we're gonna have a fight still there, also Sweden and Norway. All right, so always the fight. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> battle at the Olympics and a battle for the Olympics. Yeah. <laughs> yes. Well, thank you uh, very much for your time uh, on behalf of my producer and director, Keegan Randall, behind me. We uh, <laughs> wish you uh, all the best with your final training, and uh, we will see you in Kusumo. Yeah. yeah. Thank see you very you. much. Bye. Bye. Bye.